Hello friends, welcome to Triple X Learnings. Today we have to solve the value for x here so that we can satisfy this equation. We are knowing that 1 is equal to, you know, what is the identity to replace this one so that that identity should match with this sine power 5x plus cos power 7x so what is that so we are knowing that that is what here sine square x plus cos square x is equal to 1 so i'm just going to put this quantity put this identity over here so here sine power x plus cos power 7 x and I'm putting this one sin square x plus cos square x. Now here LHS side we are putting all the similar quantities and on the RHS side we are going to put all the same quantities. So here sin power 5x and this will come here and here sin square x. Same thing here cos square x and I am putting cos power 7x so here I can take common sin square and it will be sin cube x minus 1 and here it will be I am taking you know this one cos square x so it is 1 minus cos power 5 x we are knowing that sin x the value of sin x is always you know less than 1 or it is what could be equal to 1 you know so it is always less than 1 whatever the value for sin x or it should be it could be equal to 1 so I can go through here by putting cube on both side it is what sin cube x and that is also less than equal to 1 so it will be sin cube x minus 1 is less than equal to 0 it will be less than equal to 0 so we can say that this quantity is negative this quantity is negative and it is what positive so this is positive so negative and positive multiply together and it will give you negative in the same way we can have this one we are knowing that the cos x value is also less than equal to 1 so if I want to get this one so I am putting power 5 so it is also less than equal to 1 so I can put this result in this way cos power x this will go on the right side so it is coming greater than 0 so it is what positive it is coming positive value and here we are also having positive value because the square is already there so on the RHS side we are having positive and on the LHS side we are having negative value so positive and negative will not be equal so what we can do we have uh, only two things that one we can do sin square x and cos square x either this one will be equal to 0 so I am just putting here sin q x minus 1 equal to 0 so sin q x that is equal to 1 and 1 means what it is it should be you know pi by 2 but before going to getting pi by 2 um, taking sin q x 1 q and that is here sin x is equal to 1 that should be equal to pi by 2 so x is equal to pi by 2 I can put here and another thing is that here I can take 
you know 1 minus cos power 5x that is equal to 0 so this should be equal to 1 equal to cos power 5x so cos power 5x is equal to 1 and that could be equal to cos pi by you know cos 0 so it will be equal so you know our cos x is equal to 1 that is equal to cos 0 so x equal to we can have 0 we can add 2 pi on both sides so we have a further result so these two things are the values for the above equation so that we can get the satisfaction for our equation thank you so much for watching my video and for any latest upcoming please subscribe my channel thank you so much